Hello, and welcome to Fire Engineering Training Minutes. My name is Todd Taylor with Advanced Rescue Solutions. In this segment of Fire Engineering Training Minutes, we're going to shore a doorway where the header has started to come down because a vehicle has gone through the building. In order to do that, we're going to use Paratech struts and a 6x6. Six six. Understanding from FEMA tab data sheets, we cannot use a 4x4 four four because a span over 4 foot on a 4x4 four four would require a midpoint. Obviously, we can't do that here. In this case, we're using a 6x. It's going to span the car. It is 5 foot on FEMA tab data at 2,300 pounds. We're going to accomplish that by bringing our struts in to 5 foot apart. We'll have a little bit of overhang on the 6x, and it's going to pressurize the collapsed header. As we prepare to stabilize and shore the structure, the 6x6 header is going to go in first. Our personnel cannot be on the outside. There's simply not enough room with the car in there. So they're going to minimize their time in the danger zone. The struts are going to come in. We're going to pressurize the strut. Shoring principles that we talk about are wood to wood contact, plumb level and square. As they pressurize that, you can see on the left hand side, we don't have wood to wood contact. In order to gain that, we're going to put four by four wedges in place and wedge it. That's going to give us our wood to wood contact. And then with Paratech struts, we need to put a minimum of two nails in the head. And those nails are just tacking the head of the Paratech strut in place. As we've demonstrated in this segment, we've shored an opening that is partially collapsed. We accomplish that by using a 6x6 and two Paratech struts. We put the Paratech struts within five feet of each other. In future segments, we're going to move into the building and lift this vehicle as there's somebody trapped underneath the vehicle. Thank you for watching Fire Engineering Training Minutes. My name's Todd Taylor with Advanced Rescue Solutions.